Hi folks, uh, welcome to week two of EDU 791. That was the fastest week I've ever seen, for sure. Um, so I hope you're all doing well. And most of you, I think, know me at this point and know that I do like to do a video to um, hopefully get a more solid and personal communication with you. So uh, just a few comments about this week. Uh, I enjoyed, and I know Kat did as well, the uh, introductions that you gave and the summarization of what you're going to be doing in your project. They are um, not only very varied, but I think we're going to learn from each other immensely as we talk about them throughout the 15-week course. So uh, what's up this week? We have one item uh, is a reading from Green, and so please read that. And then there's a discussion board that pretty much goes along with it. So your prompts are ready to go. Um, our classes uh, in the internship are usually not as large as the other courses. So I have eight students, and Kat has uh, four, five, six, whatever the case may be. So four, five this time. So I will respond to my students, and Kat will respond to her students in the discussion board. Please make sure that you look at the rubric that there is um, for discussion board as well, because that's critical. Uh, you have your first response by Wednesday, and your second two responses um, engage dialogue by Sunday. And um, please don't add them all in one day, because you really don't get a good focus of what other people are saying if you do it that way. The University uh, of Graduate Professional Studies, which is where the online programs are now, has come up with a new timeliness uh, portion for discussion prompts. But if any of you know uh, or have been involved in the prompts, prompts that, um, excuse me, not prompts, discussion board rubric that I have been using, timeliness has been part of that. It also states in the syllabus that um, there's, they're really strict about lateness in assignments and discussion board. So if you have any concerns, as you've always done, email me at cmarca at une.edu, because that's the quickest way I respond, um, and we can sort it out. So I know you all have busy lives. You have jobs. You have families. You have extracurricular whatever going on. So um, I wanted to add that little piece. Or, of course, if uh, Kat's your instructor, email her. Um, in whichever fashion she prefers. I prefer my UNE email because um, I get back to you quicker. Um, and that's hopefully a strength of mine, or I try to be strong in that area. So, okay, review. We have the reading from Green, we have discussion board, and then you have your general reflection that you submit this week and pretty much every week. Um, the general reflection is a one to two um, paragraph summary. Please don't write two pages. Um, you don't have to put that much effort into it. But summarize what you did this the past week um, of your work as far as in the internship and your instructor responds to you. And again, Kat and I do it a little differently, so Kat will let her students know and, and mine I do respond every week. So uh, as long as there's a, the discussion uh, journal entry. Finally, um, log your hours. You should be logging your hours. You can add 10 hours before the course starts and only 10 hours. Um, but you can, you know, you could already log that into the log, which you'll find online, and then start logging your hours each week. Look at the log, um, and if you have any questions, again, ask us because we'll surely, you know, let you um, be successful and really uh, lessen any anxiety you even begin to have because you don't have anxiety in this class. Um, doing the internships enough and again your job. So I think that's pretty much it for now. Um, this is closed caption because it's mandated we're closed caption uh, and hopefully it pops up uh, as, as you're reading this as well. So have a phenomenal week. I'll see you on the discussion board. Uh, respond uh, or you know inquire about anything you need to and want to. If you want to look ahead, think about ahead. You'll be uh, taking some of your journal entries, your choice, adding them to your ePortfolio. Um, your log will be in your ePortfolio. In the very next upcoming week, um, Kat and I will be looking at your log just to make sure you're on target and completing it. Okay? All right. Well, have a great week. Uh, happy weekend, I hope you had. All right. Bye.